So now we're gonna work on a shorter side bang. And what I'm gonna do is take diagonal forward sections, over direct them, creating a stationary guide. And again, because we wanna go heavy, I'm keeping my elevation low and cutting uh, with my finger angle parallel to my parting. So just making sure I keep that consistent. Um, now, if you wanted to create a little more of a light feel to this fringe, what I would do is just um, suggest slight elevation after each section that you take. What I wanted to do for you guys today is just show you what that stationary guide looks like. Um, it's got a really cool feel to it and it really pushes that weight down to the cheekbone. Now I'm just connecting the opposite side using my finger angle the same way. You'll notice when I'm cutting hair, I'm using a tighter teeth comb I'm using a 339 comb from Wyatt's Park. When I go through to iron the hair, I use the, this is the 337 comb. See that nice soft angle? It's all created with over direction and finger angle, guys. So 